Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, hobbits and elves, orcs and robots, it is my immense pleasure to introduce to you on this fine day the one, the only, game of the year, every year, the kaleidoscope of madness that is Foul Space! 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 I found this insane gem of an indie game on Steam for a mere two English monies and I noticed hardly anyone had done let's plays of it and I felt this was a criminal lack of attention what uh, nothing can prepare you for what you're about to see you may have already noticed the Vikings on a conveyor belt in the background that man appears to be hitting a jug of milk I really don't think anything else needs to be said. Maybe the reason there are hardly any videos of this game is that it speaks for itself. But you know, sometimes even the best of us need a bit of help. So uh, without further ado, let's get going. Now I have not played this except to do the usual technical checks. And I noticed there is on the difficulty settings it goes easy, normal, hard and fuck my life. So. We're gonna do fuck my life mode, and this is one of those, you know, hardcore one life and you're dead, which perfectly fits my until you die format. Now let's go, I've rambled on long enough. Brace yourselves, you may want to be sitting down. I would not recommend holding hot beverages while watching this video. Okay. Okay. Go! Chicken's brains aren't nearly that big. Phew. That should give you an idea of the sort of humour this game tends to work with. So he gets in his phallic rocket and thrusts into the sky mightily. He's not one for foreplay. So yes, this game is about a chicken who gets pissed off at the sun and then is eaten by the sun like Pac-Man and uh, already you should be in love oh no Vikings well of course what else would be on the sun <laughs> and now Cthulhu is apparently attacking well that's just wonderful and now I have to charge up my massive cock cannon and shower him in white goo which is a beautiful thing. Oh yes, now here we go. This is foul space. As you can see, I'm hopping about. You can kind of flap a bit. It's a bit like Spyro, you can glide. But I think this weapon may be one of the most entertaining I've used in quite a while, because you're basically just squirting hot love all over people. There's no explanation as to how, where this came from or anything. It's pretty amazing. I think we should just let this speak for itself. Now, this visual look is quite interesting. It reminds me of Patapon, which is one of the only PSP games that anyone has ever bothered to buy. Now, wh yes, yes, yes. Oh, there's, uh, you see, the controls are a bit floaty, if I'm honest, which is kind of appropriate, I suppose, since, you know, it's a chicken and we're in space. Floating is possibly going to happen. But, you know, even the Mona Lisa is falling apart, so this is still a masterpiece, even if it isn't exactly perfect. Now, let's flap to victory. Flap, flap, flap. Ha, 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 ha. Trust me, the, you, you've seen nothing of this game, excuse me, yet. <laughs> Neither have I, really. Oh, what's going on? Um, and then a giant robot viking just landed, okay. Oh, It's about time they renamed that place, something sensible like Eurectum. See, then no one can make fun of that. Right. Okay, I seem to need to blast you with my liquid love of goo. Oh, you like it? Oh god, no, I'm dying, yeah. Are they attacking each other? No. Yeah, ah. There we go, okay. I just kind of minigun them with my love cannon. 
apparently coffee is life, which is very true, very true. But for plenty of people, coffee is a way of life. What happens if I blow this up while I'm standing on it? Probably nothing good. Okay. Can I shoot the robot viking? What? Oh no. <laughs> oh wow. Oh. That, oh. Do I need to even comment on this? This game, how can you not love this game? It's, it's basically designed for me. Oh, uh, Kung Fu Viking attack. Oh, no, come on. Uh, uh, yeah. Cannot resist my love cannon. Oh, yeah, right in the face. Time for the money shot. Oh, God. Oh, I left one. Die. I just love just squirting at them. It's so entertaining. And their, their, their little helpless cries of pain. Oh, what the, what is, what the hell, oh god, there's a killer whales, what? I don't know what's happening. Oh god, oh, this is like some horrible Lovecraftian nightmare, oh. Okay, that was very strange, but they fixed everything, yes, coffee heals all, especially cancer. Now, what, oh god, no. Die. I can't, do I even have a life bar? I can't see it if I do. I'm trying to figure out how this game works. Oh, is it the big coffee thing on the left there? Okay. Go. Yep. It makes such entertaining noises like wow, wow. There you go, stupid Vikings. Go back to Skyrim. Has anyone ever seen the Bear, the animated Beowulf movie from a few years ago? I like that movie. It's silly, but I, I like it. It's entertainingly dark. It's one of the most violent animated films I've ever seen. Select hats. Oh my god. Oh my god. Game of the year. Every year. Oh, there better be a sombrero. Come on, I'm, I'm, I'm a chicken with a cock cannon. Shooting Vikings on the sun. Wearing a hat is, and drinking coffee. But how can the, how are you not buying this game right now? Pause the video. Go to Steam. It's only two quid. There's a sale on. Go get this right now. This is going to be one of the strangest videos I've ever done. Even stranger than the cornflakes one. You know, cornflakes, cornflakes. Oh, too many Vikings. Not cornflakes. I think you can just fly over them. Ah, get out of here. What? I somehow doubt this is going to have a deep involving story, although it would be amazing if it did. What's going on here? Are we in a... what? Are we in a pub or something? Oh god, no, oh, I'm half dead. No. Oh, he's flying around the helicopter. These Vikings are just, you know, very inconsiderate. You know what this reminds me of? It's like that, um... It's like Iron Sky, you know, Nazis on the moon, only it's Vikings on the moon. Oh my god, is that a sombrero? No. I thought I had a sombrero. I'm disappointed. More cup orders, yes. That's an excellent idea. Oh! Okay, ow, oh crap, oh wow. Um, this is actually quite a situation I got myself into. Die, why aren't you dying? Thank you. Are they... they're dropping like... G-strings on me, I don't even want to know why. What were they smoking when they made this, is the question. They were high on pot noodle fumes or something, I don't even know. Oh, ah, uh, what is that? Oh god, uh. I enjoy making them blow up with my hot liquid love. Oh, another delicious G-string, which I cannot pick up, because it's- Oh, that's nice, oh thanks, game. Wonderful, wonderful, oh, this is- it's kind of hard to tell what's in the foreground and what's in the background. I thought this was a piece of the background. Oh god, no. Oh. Don't make me bagark you. Oh crap, I'm gonna die, aren't I? Oh, oh, I'm very bad at this game. Oh no. Okay, this is gonna be a short video this way. I did pick a mode called Fuck My Life, so I just kept asking for it. What was that? Was that a sombrero? I keep thinking everything I pick up is a sombrero, because I want there to be a sombrero so badly. All I have is this paper hat, which I suppose is alright, but come on. If it's not a sombrero, I'd be very disappointed. Ah. Oh, I'm trying to blow up the... There we go. Yay. 
uh, some more panties to add to my collection. I will, I will, you know, in private time later. Please. Yes. Oh man. I bet this cock has just a big harem of hens waiting for him. Oh my hero. Oh no. Oh. Well, that's true. Okay. <laughs> Well, this has been a quick and pointless little look at the greatest game ever made, Foul Space. I think this game is just proof positive that the indie scene produces the most interesting titles. You know, I don't... as if you needed further evidence. What is going on here? They're like having a piggyback. It's a human centipede of Vikings, that's just wonderful. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed this. That I, I had fun, you had fun. I'll definitely be playing more of this, not not for videos, just, you know, by myself. If you enjoyed this video, kindly like the video and subscribe and all that jazz, that's the best way to tell me to make more. Leaving a nice comment with constructive criticism would also be appreciated. And as a reward, here's a playlist over here with more of my Let's Plays. Not all of them are as strange as silly as this, but they should be entertaining if you enjoyed this one. Well, I think that, that we should move on. It's been fun. Foul space. I look forward to, you know, probing you some more later. This has just been a bit of foreplay, but then we'll get deep into it later on. Okie dokie then. Till next time, you tease. Ta-ta!